Imagine, if you will, a world beyond the boundaries of our three-dimensional understanding. A world where length, width and height are not the only ways we perceive existence. These are the dimensions we're familiar with, the dimensions that shape our everyday reality. But they're just the beginning of a much broader, much more complex universe. Now, think about time. We often consider it as a fourth dimension. It's not something you can touch or see, but it's always there, always moving, always shaping our experiences. It's the invisible thread weaving together the tapestry of our existence. But what if there were more? What if the fabric of reality were not three, not four, but nine dimensional? We're about to embark on a journey that will stretch your mind, challenge your perceptions, and take you to the very edges of what we understand about reality. What if we could traverse not just four, but nine dimensions? Let's dive into the realm of the absurdly possible. To understand a nine-dimensional reality, we first have to grasp the idea of higher dimensions. This is not a journey into the physical world as we know it, but an exploration into the abstract landscapes of mathematics and theoretical physics. Picture a point. This point with no dimensions suddenly stretches outwards, forming a one-dimensional line. Now let this line stretch sideways, forming a two-dimensional plane. The plane then stretches upwards, introducing us to the third dimension, the world we live in. We can move forwards, backwards, left, right, up and down. But what if we could stretch in another direction, one not bound by the constraints of our three-dimensional world? This is the fourth dimension, often associated with time, adding another degree of freedom. Now imagine a fifth dimension. This isn't just a new direction of movement, but a whole new universe of possibilities. It's like having numerous versions of our four-dimensional universe, each representing a different possibility or alternate timeline. The sixth dimension is a plane of all possible worlds, with the same start conditions as our universe. Here we can jump between different timelines and possibilities. In the seventh dimension, we have access to all possible worlds, with different start conditions. It's like flipping through a book of all conceivable universes, each with a different story. The eighth dimension gives us a plane of such books, each representing a different fundamental physical law. Here, universes aren't just different in terms of their timelines or conditions, but their very laws of physics differ. Finally, the ninth dimension. This is the point of ultimate possibilities. Every possible universe with every possible law of physics, starting from every possible initial condition, existing in every possible state at every possible moment. It's a mind-boggling realm of infinite possibilities. Now that our minds are primed for higher dimensions, let's consider how they would affect our physiology. In a world of nine dimensions, our bodies would need to adapt in unimaginable ways. Picture this. In the three-dimensional world we know, humans have evolved to perceive and interact within the constraints of length, width and height. But what if we add six more dimensions to this equation? Our physical forms would likely undergo dramatic changes. The structure of our bodies, the organs within, even the cells that make us up, could all become more complex to navigate and utilize these additional dimensions. Imagine the evolution of sensory capabilities. Currently, our senses are fine-tuned to interpret the world around us in three dimensions. We see objects receding into the distance, hear sounds that give us a sense of direction, and touch things that have depth and shape. But in a nine-dimensional reality, these senses could be amplified or even replaced by new ones, designed to perceive and interpret a much more complex environment. Our physical form might take on new characteristics, perhaps becoming more fluid or malleable to move through and interact with this multi-dimensional world. We could develop new ways of moving, of touching, of perceiving space and time. But it's not just about new senses or a different physical form. Our interaction with the environment would drastically change as well. In a 9D world, we could potentially move in nine different directions at once or occupy multiple spaces at the same time. We could traverse vast distances in an instant or experience time in a non-linear way. However, it's important to remember that this is all speculative. Our understanding of dimensions beyond the third is limited and our human brains are hardwired to perceive reality as we know it. The concept of a 9D human form challenges our understanding of physics, biology and the very nature of existence. But our physical form is just one piece of the puzzle. What about our cognition? 
Navigating nine dimensions would necessitate a cognitive revolution. So let's dive into the deep end of this fascinating pool of thought. In a world where space and time are woven into a complex nine-dimensional tapestry, our minds would need to evolve dramatically. Imagine, if you will, our spatial awareness. It's pretty impressive in a three-dimensional world, right? Now amplify that by three. Our minds would have to perceive and process not just the world around us, but also the worlds beside, above, below and beyond us. We'd need to perceive the complex intersections and interactions of nine-dimensional objects and spaces, a feat that would put even the most advanced supercomputers to shame. And what about memory? In a nine-dimensional world, every moment would be an intricate dance of myriad phenomena, each with their own unique nine-dimensional coordinates. Our memory wouldn't just have to remember things, it would need to remember spaces, times and dimensions. We would need to store and recall a vast amount of information just to make sense of our daily lives. Then there's problem solving. In a world with nine dimensions, even the simplest problems could have a dizzying array of solutions. Picture trying to solve a maze with nine dimensions. The possibilities would be nearly infinite. We would need to develop cognitive abilities capable of processing and evaluating a vast number of potential solutions simultaneously. But don't worry, our brains are remarkably adaptable. They've evolved over millions of years, from simple organisms navigating a two-dimensional world to complex beings capable of contemplating the mysteries of the universe. Who's to say they wouldn't rise to the challenge of a nine-dimensional world? The concept of a nine-dimensional human is mind-boggling, but it's just the tip of the iceberg. From here on, we dive deeper into the implications and possibilities of a world beyond our current comprehension. So, strap in, because we're just getting started. A nine-dimensional reality would open up possibilities beyond our wildest dreams. Let's delve into this fascinating world and explore the potential implications and possibilities. In a nine-dimensional world, technology would be profoundly transformed. Computers, for instance, could operate in unimaginable ways, with data being processed and stored in nine dimensions. This could lead to unprecedented advancements in artificial intelligence and quantum computing, pushing the boundaries of what we currently perceive as possible. Communication would evolve, too. We could possibly communicate across dimensions, reaching far beyond our current capabilities. Imagine a world where distance and time are no longer barriers, where interactions could take place instantaneously across multiple dimensions. The way we perceive, understand and interpret language could be entirely revolutionised. Science would be in for a sea change as well. Discoveries could be made that we can't even fathom now. The laws of physics as we know them might have to be rewritten. New forms of energy could be discovered, altering our understanding of the universe and our place within it. But it's not just about technology and science. The philosophical and existential implications would be equally profound. How would we perceive ourselves and our existence in a nine-dimensional reality? What would it mean for our understanding of consciousness, identity and reality itself? Would it change our perception of life and death? These are questions that would challenge us at the very core of our being. This exploration of a nine-dimensional world is undoubtedly speculative, but it's a thought experiment that pushes us to stretch our minds and our imaginations. It encourages us to question our assumptions, to challenge our understanding, and to dare to dream of possibilities beyond our current comprehension. 